There has been a growing trend in recent years of hikers replacing their sturdy walking boots with lighter trail running shoes, otherwise known as walking shoes. This trend has been brought on by the continuous development of trail running shoes, transforming them from a specialist option to the go-to choice for a wide range of outdoor pursuits, as well as their increasing availability in high street outdoor shops. Today, we're going to talk about how to choose between trail runners vs hiking boots. Now let's start the video to better understand. Protection Hiking boots are manufactured from thick material and generally have a tough sole providing protection for your whole foot. What sets hiking boots apart from trail runners, most notably, is the high ankles that help provide support prevent you from spraining or rolling your ankles. Trail runners are made from much lighter materials and generally have lighter soles too. They won't stand up to the same rigors as hiking boots, however, so protection from debris and damage won't be of the same level. Trail runners don't feature high ankles either so the protection against sprains offered by hiking boots will be lacking in these. However, the sole is narrower so you are closer to the ground, and as a result, there is a decreased risk of tripping. Durability Hiking boots when treated effectively, should last you for up to 1,000 miles of hiking. They are made with sturdy materials and, depending on the styles, will have a waterproof exterior layer that will prove effective for some time until it needs to be reproofed for further usage. Due to their lighter weight and design, you won't get the same amount of wear from your trail runners as your hiking boots. On average, you should replace your trail runners every 500 miles to prevent excessive wear that could damage your feet. Comfort, as we've previously noted, Hiking boots are made from thick materials that don't offer a whole lot of wiggle room. You'll need a snug fit for effective use so they won't yield much space, and due to the ankle support, you won't have a wide range of movement. While this helps for protection against external elements, it can also feel restrictive, so it really depends on your taste and personal preferences. Trail running shoes are more compact so they won't feel as restrictive on your feet. The material will also offer much more flexibility, so you'll have a better range of movement and flexibility. One downside to the trail runners is the narrow sole, which means you'll feel the bumps and rocks underfoot leading to potential pain after a long day in the move. Climate Hiking boots are best suited to the autumn and winter months when the weather is colder. The lighter construct of trail runners also means they dry faster, so if you do work up a sweat, that moisture won't stick around. If you're hiking in winter though, trail runners won't offer the warmth you need to get through a long day of hiking. Wait. Hiking boots are heavier by nature, although there are different material choices to diversify this. Naturally, leather boots will weigh more than suede or lightweight synthetic materials. However, they will all generally be heavier than a pair of trail runners. Designed for runners who are used to very lightweight running trainers, their greatest benefit is that they weigh less and are ideal for those who like to keep light on their feet and go for an overall lightweight kit. Water Most hiking boots will be made with waterproof materials to keep water from leaking in. Styles with mesh patches and other openings won't offer the same level of defense but predominantly, hiking boots are designed to avoid taking in water. Trail running shoes won't offer the same level of waterproof protection. Although the material may be somewhat waterproof, water will get in far easier than with hiking boots. We are almost wrapping up. These are the common differences between these two. Hope you like this video. Please comment, share and subscribe to this channel for more videos.